Welcome to Super Danganronpa Another 2. It's time to finally get into the sequel of that crazy fan game I played a while back and I surprisingly liked it. And yeah, that's all I got to say. Really, we're here to play this game. No more further ado. Let's start a new game and get into it. Yeah, I... I don't know. The last game just surprised me and I was really excited to get into the sequel and... Yeah, it's me. Um, already, 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 already. I'm just, I'm so excited. So, uh, oh, hold on. Hold everything. Ashley, I was testing this game originally because I wanted to make sure that it worked and everything. And I just want you to take a look at what I saw here. Okay, I'm just testing things out to make sure this dumb game works. This is maybe a week at least before I even start recording the series. I open up the game and I just see that dip Makoto on my screen. Why is he in this game? I have no clue what that means, but we're going to ignore that for now. Anyways, one thing I'm also excited about, there are voice lines in this game and there's a dubbed version, kind of. What I mean by that is there's a version of the game that has up to chapter two English voices. And that was probably the one thing, well, not the one thing, but what, one of the biggest things I really wanted from the original, just to have those voices. And that's a thing now. So I'm so excited to play this. And also I don't have to make up random voices. I can base them off of voices that are already existing. But yeah, let, no, no more talking. Let's get into this. So yeah, it's me. Who are you? Yes, I finally found it. I'm almost there. Come on, keyboard. Of course I'm with her. It's just that she seems to be in a bad mood. You have to be talking about the protagonist, right? Because it is a girl. I, I do know. I do know that. Wait, what? Oh, of course. You know how many years we've been searching for him. Hmm? Could you be talking about... Yeah, I know. That aside, are mm -hmm. you all right? Are you sure it's going to be okay? If you say so, I guess. Yeah, I know. I'll contact you right away if there's anything suspicious after we land. Yeah, it's time we end this. That's the only way. What? F <sighs> From the very beginning, I already don't know what's going the only on. Way those guys can rest in peace. Are you talking about... Oh, here we go again. Not the red text on the black screen. I saw the island in that dream. You were there as well. You didn't promise me anything. But you couldn't in the end. So I'm alone now. But that place became our promise. I bury my pain and suffering under the shattered pieces of that promise. First, what should I say? If I were to explain the... Who is monologuing right now? Hold everything. <laughs> Why is some of this redacted? Okay, well, we're, I'm sure we're going to hear this again in chapter 6 when we hear the whole thing. Or maybe it could be just a joke since we've we've seen this sort of like opening dialogue before. But like, what? If I were to explain the blank, who is my... What? Are you some sort of robot and you're not telling me? Like... My name is... Oh, come on! Oh, I suppose there won't be many people who are wondering about... <laughs> I hate this game already. As you can see... I'm not... I'm not... Even if it's not supposed to be um, satire, we know the opening line. And I think it's kind of funny that they're bleeping it all out, but we know w what she's saying. I'm just one of the ordinary... Or this could be glitched. That... But I don't... At any morning. Oh my god. Bro, what's going on? Okay, so we're gonna address it right away. All right. Why are you here? I am so confused. This, this can't be. You're not Yuki Maida. After everything we just went through. Why? Huh? Ah, ah, I'm so confused. Uh, sure. Okay, I'm just gonna play along. Also, is we're opening in the same exact way as Don Grappa Two, huh? You seem dazed. Not surprising, I guess. I have no idea what's going on. 
Also, is that supposed to be like the canonical uh, voice of Yuki? Or I guess in in uh, English. Oh my! God. <laughs> what an opening! I oh my! Mm. Wow. Okay, so that's interesting. So I know I didn't have to get this thing in RPG Maker, I think. Wow, this already looks way better than the first game. Also, one thing I'm excited about this game, it's going to be in completely translated English, and I don't think there's going to be any weirdness like the last game. Obviously, uh, I'm bad at reading. I read at a third grade level, but like, uh, even so, the English was pretty rough in the first game. I'm excited to read all this and not have like a lot of weird uh, translating uh, issues but anyways ah you're awake where am i i'm just as confused as you are it seems like we're on some kind of beach yeah we're on a beach and the oceans they have some weird like square curves and there are question marks everywhere where are we where am i who am i hey I have to get used to that new voice. Hey, get a grip. Your face doesn't look so good. Why am I in a place like this? Sorry. I I'm sorry, I don't know either. I woke up and here I was. I can't believe that something like this is happening on our first day of school. Still, I'm relieved. I was scared I was the only one here. So, you're a Hope Speak student too, right? Nice to meet you. Hope Speak, huh? If you ever hear Hope's peak in secession like that? Run. What? 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 You're, you're not a new student? And you don't even know what Hope's Peak Academy is? Oh, she's not. Oh, okay. Well, uh, yeah. Hope, ho Hope's who? My bad. My bad. Are you from an another country? Even so, I feel like there aren't many people who don't know Hope's Peak. Oh, here we go. We know how this goes. We know. Oh, voice acted. Cool. It's a world famous school that has produced many famous and talented people in its long history. A school that only the best, most talented students get to attend. It isn't an exaggeration to call it the school of hope. It literally is the hope of our country. Uh, sure, hope of our country. Uh huh. There are two conditions to enter the school. You must be a high school student. You must be the best at your given talent. Only students who have been scouted to come to the school can attend. And today was the first day of school for those new students. So, are you one of those best of the best students? Or, or are you just some lame kid that got called lucky? Or maybe you're an impersonator! Aw, oh, shucks. Best of the best? That's a bit embarrassing. I'm really nothing special. Sorry for the late introduction. I'm Yuki Maida. This year is ultimate lucky season. Oh, is it Maida? Oh, God. That means I pronounced it wrong the entire series. <laughs> Whoops. I mean, that sounds about right coming from me. I pronounce everything wrong. But also, you are not Yuki Maida! Maida, whatever. I'm not gonna get over this. He literally just said lucky student. Not even the ultimate question mark or impersonator. I'm so confused. Okay, I see the game going hard at the beginning. Give me this existential dread since I already have questions. But just show me the stupid splash art. Yuki, I feel like I've heard that name before. I feel like I've heard someone say your name before, but incorrectly. Anyways, I really thought for sure that you were one of the new students. I'm thinking. I need to stop thinking. I can't, I can't theorize. It's only the beginning. Hope's Peak Academy. It sounds familiar. How, how about you? My name? What is her name? Wait, it got bleeped out. Wait, if she says it, then I have a theory. But let me just hear it out. Why? What am I? Hey. Uh, you all right? You don't look so good. Hope's Peak Academy. My name? Yuki Beach. What is this? What's wrong with me? Who am I? 
Ah. Uh, are you alright? Hey! Sora. Wait, her name's Sora? That's the only thing I can think of. Also, she has a voice. Oh, that's hype. Yeah, she, she has actually has voice lines. That's cool. Wait, why am I getting excited? Never mind. No one told me I was about to be playing Kingdom Hearts. I got it now. So the point of the game is to prove that Kingdom Hearts is light. Huh. Sora? Doesn't that mean empty? Really? Is that your name? I don't know. It's just that word and Hope Speak Academy together makes me feel kind of weird. Are you saying you can't remember anything? Do you have an amnesia or something? Your name, house, school, family, you can't remember any of them? I guess so. Maybe some kind of drama made you lose your memories. It might be related to the situation at hand. If it's alright with you, do you mind if I tag along? We should be- or we should probably be sticking together in a situation like this. And I couldn't po uh, possibly leave someone with amnesia behind. Yes, I'm okay with that. Right. Okay then, I'm counting on you, Sora. I don't know if that's my real name or not. I'll call you by that for now. It'll be hard to call someone without a name you know. Alright, you can call me that. Yuki. It's gonna, it's gonna take me a little bit of time to get used to these voices, but... This game is already really wild. All right. Okay, so let's see what we got here. Let's look around. Yeah, I lost my memory. I don't know what's going on. But we should at least know the situ uh, situation that we're in. And hopefully we'll find out why I don't have a memory. It's always the memory that we're missing. Um, so Yuki got a letter from Hope's Peak. And well. told her told him to show, show up somewhere. Entry ceremony. So, stuff we, we already know. Uh, I read it uh, I read it myself and headed there, but... Sorry. Sorry, I can't remember that uh, much after that. I definitely remember going somewhere, but I can't remember where, or how I got to this beach. I can't remember anything at all. It looks like you're the same as me. I guess so. I guess so, but it's not like my memory's completely gone like yours, though. Are you connect? It's too soon to say. I had a look around earlier, and it seems there are a few more people on the island besides us. You're the other freshmen, so let's go yes. look for them! A little over 10 kids. How many? 16. I was like, oh, how many shucks. are there usually? Oh, shucks. This is a little embarrassing to admit. I'm sorry. It seems... we I've never had voice lines to lean on for Yuki, so it, it feels weird for him to go, Oh, shucks. But also, that feels like... That feels like him. This is a... This isn't Yuki, though! Who are you? I feel like your whole existence is a lie! Um... Th oh, shucks. This is a little embarrassing to admit, but... After I was guided to Ten Hope's Peak, I did some research on the internet and stuff. You're probably just another Hope's Peak student. Well, well, yeah, I was thinking the same thing. It's just that you've lost your memory. It's the only way that makes sense, and you're wearing a uniform too. Oh. Otherwise, it wouldn't make sense. You're also wearing a school un uh, uniform after all. Then let's look around for- I feel like- did you say- I don't know why I thought he said that twice. Then let's look around. Yeah, let's look around. Come on, let's figure this out. All right. Oh man, this is. Uh, we're classmates. Yeah, classmates. We're totally not enemies. Welcome to. I'm sorry. Does that say Utsuroshima? Oh my. <laughs> Welcome to Utsuroshima, the Isle of Nowhere. Wait, wasn't that literally the um, the subtitle of the of the game? Anyways, the Island of Overflowing Hopes and Dreams. This is a bad omen, because whenever you see hope, you know there's something else right behind it. Okay, so we got the controls. Uh, oh, we can go in eight directions, all right. I'm guessing the last game had controller support, which is helpful because my setup is usually weird. I mean, my setup is weird right now because it's not my normal setup, even so. That's why my quality ain't the best, but uh, I'm guessing this game doesn't have controller support. But anyways, uh, confirm with C or space or enter. Confirm key. So simple stuff. Uh, press the confirm key while holding down control uh, during dialogue to move through the text quickly. I'm definitely gonna need that whenever I mess stuff up. Uh, and that's how you bring up the menu screen. I'm while you uh, while you can only save for now. This menu. Okay. 
I definitely would love... Dang. Yeah, eventually, I think, at least listening to this right now, the, the sound effects are a bit loud, so I'm probably gonna turn them down whenever I get the chance. But let me go ahead and save the game. Why not? What would that look like if I try to load? Am I gonna... Okay, all right. This is, a, this is very charming, I'm, I'm gonna say. Also, uh, I'm gonna try my best this series. I don't know how well this is going to go, but I'm going to try my best to make as little cuts as possible. I feel like there's definitely gonna be some uh, exceptions to that, but uh, more recently, I've had such short, or not short, uh, smaller amounts of time to record and edit. So I wanna make the, uh, the edits I do a lot simpler. And also, I feel like it would be better for these sort of videos to not cut stuff out as much. But at the same time, I may do that just for, just because it's kind of like, I don't want to say an artistic taste, but just a second decision. It will be a work in progress, but I'm probably going to take things slow for this, at least from the very beginning. Oh, I might as well get this out of the way now. Uh, if you haven't played the other Donkey Rapid games, there are going to be spoilers in this. I'm just going to say that now. I imagine people that are watching this already know that and they've played the other games but just in case uh let's go up <laughs> that's that's who oh png oh a cruise oh Whoa. we're saved what's with this huge boat we can get off unless it's a prop perfect uh bizarrely painted half white and half black it looms over the beach silently Hmm. That worries me a little. Well, I mean, it's a sign of hope. Let's get on. Hello, who are you? Um. Ah, oh, shit. Uh, let's see if I can do this. Where did I? Where did I go wrong? Can't say this has ever happened before. Guess I might have overlooked something, or maybe I. Hey, hello. Yeah, I gotta turn down these sound effects later. Um, Are you a host peak student? I don't know any of that crap. So you're not from host peak? Well, looks like I was wrong. In here, I thought I could live a, re a relaxing island life by myself, but it looks like I wasn't alone. What? It's like this. I can't sort through any of this crap around us. That's what. Like my head's all foggy. Wait, we're, we're, uh, we were trying to figure out what's going on too. I'm a freshman at Hope's Peak Academy, and after going to a certain place on the day of the entrance ceremony, I lost consciousness and woke up here. If, you, if you've got any idea what's going on, and what do I get if I tell you, or out of it if I tell you, eh, I don't have a clue anyway. What? Don't you think that's a bit harsh? If you're a freshman too, you should at least tell me your name, since we're going to be classmates, you know? Um, I think it's considered polite to offer your own name before asking for someone else's. My bad. Uh, well, I guess you're right. Um, oh, I'm Yuki Maida. Maida. <laughs> I'm going to get that down, I swear. And I was scouted as the ultimate lucky student. I'm Sora. I ended up with Amnesia somehow, so I can't remember much beyond this possibly fake name. It sounds very... I don't know, I just think of a, a mouse when I say it. Amnesia? Yes. Could you tell us your name now? I mean, it's only natural since we just met. This is useless. Nah, me? That crap's point pointless info. Cuff of about a million and I'll talk? No! Are you for real? Uh, <laughs> Ryuji? A, a million for just getting to know your name? Are you crazy? Are you serious right now? Just for a name? Dang, talk about harsh. A person's name is worth more than you think. Your name re represents everything that you are. No point in wasting time in, on someone who's uh who doesn't value that. If you're not for that, scram. Hey, bro, I think I gotta get these voices down. And he's gone. Wow, jerk. Maybe he's not. No, nah, he's a student. He just sucks. Maybe. But it seems like everyone who's here should be attending Hope's Peak. Well, if he is a student, he'd probably stay for the ceremony. So let's try that, or let's try again later. 
What if I talk to him again? Ah, oh, shit. Oh, is this the same thing? Uh, okay, cool. What we have here? It's just a palm tree. What happens if I try to go up here? Um. Wait, why can't we go onto the boat? The door appears to be locked. Of course it is. Sounds about right. You're right. Brody, these voices. Mm. The stairs are there, but it looks like the doors are locked. What kind of boat is this? It says Monocruise on the side of the boat. That scares me. Well, anyways, we should probably go check out another place. Let's find more people! This is going to take a minute. I'm... My plan is for this... For the... Just for this beginning. I'm going to do either the entire prologue or just do it until I meet everyone. Whichever comes first. Go to the world map. Uh, sure. Oh, just... Oh, oh god. <laughs> okay, no. It doesn't look as goofy as the uh, uh, original Dark Rampa 2. Well, here you have a market. And here we have another person. Cool design, I'll say. Hey. Hey there. Are you a Hope Speak student? Or your Hope? Uh, uh, words are hard. Your Hope. Uh, yeah, your student. Whatever. That's right. Yes. Me too. Nice to meet you. I'm Yuki Maida. Ah, the ultimate lucky student. I'm Sora. Right. Right. Freshman students. And you? Kokoro Mitsume. Ultimate psychologist, I believe. Kokoro Mitsume. Okay. Kokoro? Yeah, I got it. Incredible! Oh, wow, a psychologist, that's amazing! I feel like there's a reason that she's a psychologist. Maybe she had. Either she's weird or she had some weird dark past. Or maybe both. Um, hey, but if by any chance you know yes. where this island is. Or how we ended up here? That's what you want to ask. Uh, uh, how'd you know? Unexpected. <laughs> they can get away with that because this is not a soul game. This is a fan game. Pulling out the iPad and all. I'm analyzing it right now. Oh wow, that that caught me off guard. Hold on. Okay, we're we're on the island. There's no internet connection. I was about to say if you have an iPad, then try to get us off this island. But anyways, analyzing. There's no internet connection here. Yeah, figured. So I'm trying to find another way. But isn't that... We had all of our belongings taken away, so how could I possess this? Right! Is it a part of your being? Is it just attached to you? That's what you're curious about. You're so predictable. I mean, yeah, I'm Yuki Maida. What do you expect? I'll explain. I simply procured one from the store, since I always carry a pack of memory card. What? But shouldn't you pay for that? It's fine. What, you gotta snitch? If you're concerned about payment, there is no need. I searched the island, and aside from a few students, it is uninhabited. It doesn't appear that anyone owns the store. Still, it doesn't seem right. It's pointless. Irrelevant. Something is going on with us. We can make uh, uh, reparations later. That's a cool sprite. Uh, you're right. I should take some food as well. Woman, do you want me to starve? What? Uh, what is it, Kokoro? Interesting. What are you? Oh god, she said what? She said what? I. S is she a robot? Hold on. Spongebob about preparing me for this. If she can't love, she can't laugh, and she ran out of batteries, then that means she's a robot. Nah. There's no way I got it from the very beginning. I think I'm wrong. Maybe she's... That, let me just keep reading. Also, what am I... That's a bit rude, you know. No, never mind. Did I do something to offend her? Well... I don't know. She seems difficult. It's like she could predict everything I was going to say. She probably already figured out the mastermind and she's just keeping quiet. Maybe she can read minds since she's a psychologist. That's not how that works. Anyways. Oh, hello. Who are you? Hey. Hey, are you a Hope Speak student? Yeah, well. 
Well, who are you guys? Well, I am, but... I knew it. Nice to meet you. I'm Yuki Maida. I'm not used to that. This year's ultimate lucky student. Ah, so you're a classmate of mine. I'm Hajime Makunochi, ultimate boxer. Nice to meet you. Man, you, I can tell you could take Yuki out in one punch. That's incredible. I've heard of you. You're that prodigy boxer. The one that's beaten all of those adult pros. <laughs> nice one. <laughs> Stop. You're going to make me blush. I've still got a long ways to go, you know. That's why I need to take extra good care of my health. Sora, nice to meet you. Cool. Yeah, just call me Hakume. But do you only go by Sora? Sora has amnesia. Uh, I just met her and she says she can't remember anything before coming to this island. But... Man, really? They say a good memory ties in with good health. You should try some protein. If there's anything I could do to help, let me know. Hachibei, do you have any idea how we ended up on this island? Yeah, well... Well, I can't say I do, no. But relax. I doubt anything bad is gonna happen. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, knock on this wood right by me. Speaking of relaxing, here, have an energy drink. Got um, plenty of protein. Uh, uh no, I'm, I'm fine. Hey. hey, a scrawny dude like you should care more about your health, you know. You gotta focus on your health while you're young. Oh, shucks. But I'm you're the same age as you. Uh, you sound like my mom. I'll take an energy p uh, drink, please. I wanna try it. It's good for you. Sure thing. Nothing more important than caring about your health. And if you have any questions, feel free to come to me at any time. Hajime, aren't you cold wearing something like that? Yeah, you, you have no shirt and shorts on. What are you saying? But that doesn't really have anything to do with health. Clothes just get in the way of my training is all. Or that's all. Are you a pervert? How do we get there? Hey. What'd you just say? You making fun of boxers? You want to go? What does that have to do with boxing? Uh, uh, don't worry about it. Let's just run away before he punches us. Here we have what I assume to be a park. Oh, I think we have twins down there. Well, before that, who are you? Oh, ho! Oh, cute kid spotted. You must be Hope, uh, Hope's Peak Academy freshman too, right? Um, um, hello? Um, I guess you're soon too? Good to meet ya. Your big sis here is named Setsuka Chiyabukuro. Hope we get along. Yeah, that's a hard name to pronounce. Ultimate Billiards Player. Okay, so that means one thing and one thing only. You're really good at whacking people with a stick. I've come to this school as the Ultimate Billiards Player. Ah. Uh, Chibukuro? I've heard of that name before. You've won a... A world billiards championship before, right? Yep. Yep, that's right. I haven't gone to a lot of tournaments, but I've gotten sort of famous for winning perfect games from or four to ones I have attended. Incredible. Probably attended like one. It just blows my mind that you're uh, that you completely destroyed a pro. Like, you must be really a genius. You really must be a genius. My bad. <laughs> <laughs> nah, it's not like that. My dad's a billiards player, but I actually don't even know how to what. Nah, that's like saying you're a pro Smash player, but all you've ever played is like Street Fighter. That makes no sense. Huh? Then how did you get your title? Hey, hey. Now, now, that's a secret, my boy. It's dangerous to pry into a woman's um, intimate secrets. Aside from that. But enough about that. I've yet to hear your names. Uh, right. I'm Yuki Maida. Maida. Oh my God. Uh, the ultimate lucky student. And this is Sora. Oh. You and Ra Ra <laughs> Ra Ra, uh, sure. Lucky student and uh, what's up with her? R Ra Ra? Uh, she seems to be suffering from amnesia. She can't rem remember anything. Oh dear. Oh dear. One thing. I thought amnesia was something you only see in movies and uh, video games. But uh, relax. Memories don't disappear that easily. You should be able to get them back sooner or later. That aside, you sure do look calm at a time like this, Suzuka. What? What is it, you? Are you calling me simple-minded? <laughs> no, I didn't mean it like that. It's just a situation that we're in. Hmm? 
You mean being on a mysterious island where God knows what could happen? Don't remind me. The scary thing about these games, not just the fan games, but all the games, anything can happen. Is there something you are telling us? Just kidding. Nope. Um. Then why, how are you coming here so peaceful? Hey, hey. You guys are being so, or too serious. The world is pretty a pretty uh, peaceful place about about that. Maybe this is a surprise event uh, set up by the school or something. This island is beautiful, you know. Seize the day. That's my life motto. My devil's eye. And if something happens, don't worry. With my devil's eye. <laughs> um, I, I'll pass on that. <laughs> this eye has some very special powers. <laughs> <laughs> Wasn't that funny? No. You're too stiff, you know. Just relax. Well, I'm off to chat with the other kids. Okay, she seems cool. And loud. She seems pretty cool in the article I read, but wow. She seems like a simple-minded per uh, person. That's... Sora, you're kind of harsh, you know. I mean, she's not wrong. I, okay, okay. Here's the thing. Part of me thinks they're not actually related, but they just dress the same. And, in, and they look very similar. Knowing these games, there would be no relation between these two, but I'm probably wrong. Let's see. Yay! They're young. And, oh my god, they're like, they're J-pop stars, aren't they? Oh god. Uh, what's that one anime that had the famous singer and like the babies? Like, I'm just remembering the one thing where they're like swinging the light sticks around in unison and they blew up. That was like a big anime kind of recently, and I just kind of thought of that. Anyways. Whoa, uh, whoa uh, a child. <laughs> you were totally surprised, were you? Um. Hey, Kanade. Hey, Kanade. Why didn't you do it like I told you? Thanks to, uh, thanks to you, this girl wasn't surprised at all. I'm sorry. Uh, I'm sorry, Hibuki. Hey, hey. Call me sis. Uh, why, why, why do you suddenly think you can call your sister by her name, huh? Am I your friend or something? Uh, sorry, sis. Please don't be angry. What is happening? Um, which is which? Ah, my intro. By the looks of your clothes, you must be Hope Speak uh, freshman, right? I'm Hibiki Otonotoji, and she's Kanade, my twin sister. Okay, they are twins. What was I saying earlier? Also, uh, Hibiki and Kanada. I can't pronounce your last name, so I'm not even gonna try. Ultimate vocalist. What is the other one? Ultimate guitarist. Okay. Oh, I see the difference. They're they're hair pin things. Okay. Oh, you're the oh my god. You're the Otsuno Koji's from the popular band Melody Rhythm. Okay, so I was close. Yep, yep. Naturally, you've heard of us. We were top of the charts just last week. We got scouted as the um, ultimate vocalist and the ultimate guitarist. Incredible. Wow, I can't believe two famous celebrities are right in front of me. By vocalist and guitarist, you mean you two are in some sort of band? I've never heard of it. <laughs> Wait, what? You never? You seriously have never heard of us? Uh, You're the worst. It's impossible. How can you not know us? Why, Kanade? Right? Kanade? I guess there's no choice. Get ready for a live performance. We're going to show these people who we are right here, right now. I swear to God, you please don't sound bad. <laughs> I can't take that again. Wow. Uh, uh, that'd be impossible, sister. We don't have any instruments or, or speakers or talent. What was that? Uh, uh, nothing. Impossible. You're disobeying your uh, dear sister's, uh, sister's orders, huh? Is that it? Huh? Huh? No, sis. It's nothing like that. Sorry. It's just a joke. You're such a, uh, such a scaredy cat. Obviously, we, we aren't going to perform live right here. Even I can ma or not or words. Not even I can manage that. Um. Um. Please don't fight. Uh. We should really all try to get along. Huh? We're, we're not fighting. We're always like this. I'm just joking around, you know. You're joking around. Is your sister joking around? Also, there's no way that one of them doesn't die by the end of this. Like, there's no way. Anyway, you two really do look identical. Or identical. But I can tell the difference. I guess in their mannerisms right now, but also their hair pieces are different uh, notes. So, 
Uh, not really. Sis looks way cooler. <laughs> Duh. Well, I'm Yuki Maida. Maida. I'm Lucky, and this is Sora. Uh, what? Luck? What kind of talent is that? Oh, shucks. Uh, it's hard to explain. I just got accepted because of a raffle. <laughs> so it's like a lottery? <laughs> I get it. Say. Um, Miss Sora, what's your last name? Sora? I, I don't remember. Yeah, we have more amnesia, yada yada yada. Wait, amnesia? S seriously? That must be tough. Do either of you know what's going on here? Uh, what's going on? Uh, uh, isn't this a surprise ceremony? That's what the blue haired girl over there told us. Hmm. A surprise event? Hmm. Oh, we gotta go. We saw something really fun over there. Imagine it's just like a pile of rocks and a couple of twigs, but you're just saying that just so they go away. Better brace yourself, Sora. After hearing us live, you'll be addicted to our music. Let's go, Kanata. Let's just wait for me. Bro, I'm getting more and more excited to play this game. Will I, will I really end up addicted or will I just plug my ears? That aside, everyone seems to be way too calm right, right now. Those twins are super immature. Well, well, they're kids. What do you expect? Well, they're still huge, uh, huge celebrities in the music industry, though. Okay, she. I can see what they're doing. I can see they're kind of giving her a little bit of like those Hajime vibes. Not Hajime, the person we just met, but Hajime from the original Danganronpa franchise. And I think it works better, at least with her. I don't know. Uh, I am liking her because I feel like she has a little more personality than Yuki already. Anyways, uh, are you a Hope's Peak student? Hey, hey. Oh, Jesus Christ! What a weakling! What? D -d -duh. Right. Your face is weak. Your voice is weak. Now give me a fiery shout with all you've got. We've got the next Neko over here. Uh, uh, Hope's Peak. Not enough fire! Are you a Hope's Peak Academy student? That's right, I'm a Hope. Uh, <laughs> That's right, I'm a Hope's Peak Academy student! <laughs> this is going south fast. Shit. Okay, I like Sora. I like Sora. Dude, you should have told me earlier there's this girl. Oh, man, it's so embarrassing. Oh shucks. It's okay. <laughs> that voice clip is so stupid. It's okay. I'm just as embarrassed as you are. Uh, anyway, nice to meet you. You must be my classmates, right? I'm the ultimate firefighter, Shinji Kasa. <laughs> he talks so normally now. Oh my gosh. Anyways, here we have Shinji. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, I my mind went straight to Shinji from Persona Free. I'm worried. Uh, nice to meet you. I'm the ultimate lucky student, Yuki Maida. Oh, right. Uh, oh, luck. I've heard every year that we, we have a lottery for the ultimate lucky student. Must have been you. Well. Yeah, so I'm nothing really special. Really nothing special. I also can't talk. No. Too soft. Be more confident, would you? Say it with me. I'm the world's greatest guy. Uh, not this again. I'm the world's... <laughs> I'm the world's greatest guy! Ah, I'm, I'm ugly and I'm proud! Yeah! yeah! Sword's over here like, shut the F up. I will die. Yo, Yuki, you should've told me there was a girl watching I wanna kill myself out of that, that calm down there. Hey, wait, this is your fault, isn't it? Pay attention. That's it, Yuki. I like you a lot. Come here, big bro, for now on. I'll train ya. What? Wait, wait, what? Don't sweat it, kid. I had to drop out of high school for a few years because of an injury. <laughs> There's so many things to break down in that one sentence alone. Okay, so, sure, you had to stop something because of an injury. But why'd you have to drop out of a high school because of an injury? And for a few years! <laughs> Jesus. What? That's not the problem. Can I call you big bro, too? <laughs> no, you shouldn't. Jeez, a girl just talked to me. Um, um wait, are you? Uh, uh, 
the names uh, Shinji, K Kasai, Kasei, whatever. I wasn't listening. I'm a humble firefighter, and and you, Sora. Uh, I hope we can get along. <laughs> Aren't you a softie? Get over here and Big Bro will personally train you. Start with some laps. What? Wait, wait, I wanted to ask you some. Ah, I'm running. What an interesting person. Sora is not at all who I thought she was going to be like. Because I've seen her character art before. And I thought she was going to be just a standard kind of positive. Honestly, I thought I was going to get another Kaede. But that's not the case. But that's kind of cool. I like how she's different from, I guess, as, except from Hajime, all the other protagonists, so. Next on the map is some building. Oh, we're, we went inside the building. So here we have, here we have the Phantom of the Opera, and where is Carmen Santiago? Let's start with you. You two! Yeah, you! Stop right there! Your interview starts now! Huh? You're too slow! Obviously, you guys are from Host Peak, right? Names and talents pronto! Uh, I'm Yuki Meta and I'm the ultimate lucky student. Maida, whatever. Uh, I'm nervous around reporters. Or, er, what are you? Sora, I have amnesia, so I can't remember my talent. Now that's a scoop! Amnesia? What a scoop! I'll shut that down for you right now! Whoops, forgot my own intro. Silly me. Wherever there's a scoop, my pen is never far behind. Ultimate journalist Nikkei Yomiyuri at your service. What are you doing? Right. Right. I'm gathering info, of course. It's important to know stuff about your classmates, right? Before you do that, Nikkei? Uh, do you have any idea where we are? We kind of just woke up here. Great question! Unfortunately, I have no clue either! <laughs> you could cut the tension with a knife right now. This whole situation is one big scoop, so I need to be on my guard. Huh? Hey. Anyway, Yuki was it? Uh, yeah. Jeez. Man, you're awesome. It's literally the first day and you're already hanging out with a girl. My guy. Uh, it's not like that. Sora has no memory, so I'm just helping her out. Hey, I'm only saying that because I'm jealous. I'm gonna go see who else I can find for now. We'll continue this next time. Catch you on the flip side. He certainly seems busy. Is getting image really scoop worthy? Like, don't worry about it. He, he was probably just saying that. He's probably just bored. Like, he went in this room of all play. What is this? An altar with the statue of the Virgin Mary. Is there a mass about to happen? I'm so confused. So we're just in like a cathedral. I'm anyways. <laughs> oh my god. Hey. Um uh I don't even know what to say. I can't even see his face expressions. Nice to meet you. I'm Yuki Maida, the ultimate lucky student. I'm Sora. What's that? Oh my. Are you mute? It says Ultimate Wizard Mikado Senoji. Oh. So you're Mikado, but you're a wit. Oh, is it? Okay. I. Uh, sure, why not? Um. Um. And he left. Shoot. What's with that guy? He won't talk. He wears a freaky mask. That hat's ugly. I feel like that, or that it's a victory that even told us his name. <sighs> okay. Moving on. I don't know how many people we have left. Here we have. <laughs> All right, off the grandma's house. Like, what is this? Oh, wait, this is the lodge area, I imagine. It's probably where we're going to be staying and stuff. Maybe. We haven't found the resonant meme person yet, so maybe it's you? Ooh, newcomers, hello! Oh, hi. You're here for uh, Hope Speak 2, right? Yes! I'm the ultimate painter, Iroha Nijiwe. Hope we can get along. New uh, 
Nijue? I definitely wasn't listening to what she said. I've heard that name before. Ah, uh, you you probably have. My my family's got a long line of uh, fa uh family family. My family's got a long line of uh, famous artists. It's kind of a tradition. I see. I would love to get to see one of your paintings if I ever get the chance. Sorry for the late introduction. I'm Yuki Maida, the ultimate lucky student. I'm Sora. Oh, oh lucky student? So you're like super lucky and stuff like that? No, no, not really. I'm just some average kid who happened to have his name drawn out of a hat. I'm totally not uh, an imposter. <laughs> that, that's not true. <laughs> You're totally an imposter. Uh, no. Um, the fact that you were even chosen in such a big lottery is amazing in itself. What a fantastic school. Uh, I guess so. Sora, what about you? What's your talent? Don't know. Huh? That's... Sora can't remember anything from the past few hours, or from before. <laughs> she can't remember anything up till this point. No, she has amnesia. <laughs> you lost your memory? That's awful. And it's our first semester and everything. But don't worry. Think positively. Your memories will be com definitely be coming back. Even if they don't, you can just replace them with the uh, happy memories you make with us. Huh. I'm so sad because I know that positivity is going to go down the window. You're oddly cheerful. Are you always like that? Um, you're Roja. Do you know anything about our situation? Oh, you mean the island and all? Well, naturally, I was upset to find out we're in the middle of nowhere. Positive, stay positive. But it sounds like these words, staying positive is more important than ever. See, it's the first day on a beautiful island with brand new friends. Of course I'm cheerful. Um. So you... Don't know why we're on this island either. Of course. Uh, yeah, but don't worry too much. Even if we wait, I'm sorry that that smile. Uh, maybe if we wait long enough, the teachers or somebody else will contact us. I'm gonna go see um, other friends. See you later. Again, that the happiness is gonna go down the window, and I'm so sad. It's good to see her smile, but I think she's a bit too positive. I agree. I'm getting hippie vibes. <laughs> Oh, I'm totally wrong. Hmm. Hello. Uh huh. Uh, a girl. Uh um. Uh, uh hi. Yuki, what? Uh, are you the famous actress Emma? Mi oh, God, Magorobi. Oh. You recognize me? I'm honored. Of course I do. You're one of the main uh, characters in the Harry P Harry Peter, and I loved you as Holly Queen. Ah, <laughs> oh, you're too kind. I, so you're a whole speak academy soon too? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, I've decided to take a break and fo uh, focus on my studies for a while. For now, I'm not famous actress Emma Mogorobi, but just your classmate, ultimate actress Emma Mogorobi. Hello, I'm Sora. Greetings. Seriously? What should I do? A famous celebrity is my classmate. Uh, I, I gotta fix my uh, whole game, make sure it's all straight. Uh, uh, sorry for the late introduction, Miss uh, Makarobi. I'm the ultimate lucky student. Um, uh, Maida Yuki. I mean, Yuki Maida. I mean, Yuki Maida. Uh, um, uh, I'm a big fan. Uh, a pleasure to meet you. But you don't have to speak so formally. We're pra practically uh, the same age. What? Uh, but I can't imagine speaking so casually to a Hollywood star. I insist. I'll, I'll say, never mind. Um, I'd prefer if you did. As I said, I'm here to focus on school. I don't want my classmates to treat me like a celebrity. Sora, was it? You can address me however you want as well. I'm more comfortable speaking this way, so it's alright. Yes. Uh, yes, miss. Uh, I mean, uh, uh, I understand. I'm just such a huge fan. <laughs> I'm flattered. I apologize. Since you seem to be quite famous, I might have recognized you if I uh, if it weren't for my amnesia. Huh? Amnesia? Yeah, I can't remember anything. Ah. Uh, right, Mr. Uh, Emma. Do you know why we're here of all places? Today was supposed to be our entrance ceremony. I'm... Well, I'm not certain. Whoops. Uh, <laughs> some habits just never be able to bite me in the butt. I'm thinking it must be some sort of surprise party arranged by... Um, no! Listen. Yuki, Sora, you shouldn't worry so much. Look how... Everyone's saying not to worry and it's worrying me. 
Look at how beautiful and blue the sky is. Something good would happen or will happen. I just know it. Things that were lost, things that have happened, let's put it all behind us. But here's the thing. She has to be a diva, right? I feel like she's not always this calm. If she doesn't get her way at some point, I feel like she's going to lose it and just go like full diva. We should simply be thankful for the world we live in now. Cut the crab. I know you're hiding something. It's Sora! <laughs> Sorry, that must have uh, sounded strange. It must be the actor in me. <laughs> Maybe. I can understand what you're saying, though. Miss Magarobi. Yeah, my, my friend Sora here is such an idiot, right? <laughs> hey. Yuki, what did I tell you? Oh, oh, right. Sorry. Now then. I'm going to head out now. It doesn't seem like there's much more that can be accomplished by staying here. It seems there are many more freshmen around. Yeah, there's a lot more to get to. This is the part that always sucks, trying to introduce myself to everyone. One of my least favorite parts about these games, honestly. Uh, it's kind of interesting. We didn't have the whole, like, PNG of everyone in one group in its hands. Yuki, did your jaw just drop? Ah. Uh, what, what are you talking about? You had your mouth open the whole time. Uh, it's not like that. I was just admiring her as a fan. Uh, anyways. Oh, they got TV? Oh, you got TDI on here? Hold up. Unfortunately, there's something but static. Uh, here we have the weirdest looking docks I've seen in my life. These are the dorms. These are where we're going to be living. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Here we have some pink haired girl. We have... Uh, I, I can't even tell who you are. Anyone else? No, that's it. So let's start with you. Jeez. Jeez, this is annoying. What are the teachers doing? Um. Uh, excuse me? Huh? Uh, who are you? Uh, are you another student here? Uh-huh. And if I am? Uh, uh, nice to meet you. I'm Yuki Maida. Maida. God, every time. Those my lucky student. I'm Sora. So you're a freshman too. I'm Yoko Kabuya. I hope we can get along. Is she the ultimate like hostess? Um. I, I was wondering, do you have any idea how we ended up on this island? Uh. Uh. You, you know what? I was wondering about that just now. I went to the place they told me to go, and then I passed out. When I woke up, I was here on this island. What? Were we like kidnapped to work as slaves or something? Yes. Yeah, I'm worried too. Oh no, I have a bad feeling about all this. Or, or what are the teachers doing any- That's a good question. Even if it was some kind of event, no one gave us any contact or contract or extra notice. I can't believe I had to stop working because of this. Working? Uh, uh, yeah, I haven't touched my talent yet. You'll probably take this- Yeah, I, I very much took this the wrong way already because I was like, okay. But, uh, I got in as the ultimate hostess. Uh, uh, hostess, but you're only a high schooler. Look. Look, I was having some problems, so I faked my age in order to work. I can see how you fooled people. Uh, I was sure no one or nobody w um, would be able to find out. But I got busted. I don't know how they figured it out, but next time I knew there was an um, accepted... Oh, okay. There was an acceptance letter at work with my name on it. <sighs> so they gave me a choice. Jail or Hot Peak. So here I am. That's actually really funny. So you must hate the school, right? Don't think so. Nah, not really. I'll be old enough to work legally in a few years anyway. I figure I can gain some fame here and use that to get a better, a better gig in the future. But seeing myself in a place like this instead is just pissing me off. Now I get it. Is that why, um, uh, it, it, you're wearing, um, um, that's a bit revealing, you know. Hey. I had no choice, you know. I didn't want to wear this. Oh, okay. We were told to wear clothes that matched our talents, remember? Oh, that's why Yuki looks like a very boring person. But why am I just dressed? I'm pretty sure I'm dressed in a, just a regular outfit. How does that work? Fascinating. Yuki... I can see you trying to peep. What? what? No, no, I, I, I'm not. <sighs> well, that's nothing new to me. I mean, for me. Just don't take this the wrong way. My job isn't what you think it is. I think it's pretty incredible. Huh? Y y you do? Well, that's a first. Well. 
Hmm. Anyway, you don't know any details about anything, right? Don't think so. Nah. I've been trying to look around, though. I just hope nothing bad happens. Yeah, I hope, to, uh, I hope so, too. That was an interesting one. Okay, I'm guessing you're the last person? Oh, my. Uh, what are you? Beautiful. You're beautiful. Ah, uh, uh, weirdo. I am at your service. You're Russian. This voice is probably going to be the worst one because I'm not even going to attempt to do a Russian accent. But greetings. And what might be the name of this lady? Oh, me? Well, I um, I go by Sora. Oh, I go by Sora. Your name is wonderful. I'm the ultimate spaceman, Yuri Kagami. Please remember that. Nice to meet you. Are you actually from space? What kind of stupid question is that? Wonderful. Not just looks, but a great sense of humor too. You're even more charming than I thought. Everyone who works in the astronomy industry is referred to as a spaceman. There are a lot of sub uh, subcategories, but you can think of me as a space pilot. Ah, uh, but I can be whatever you want me to be. My dear. Hey. Hey, back off. <laughs> You're completely ignoring me. Who are you? Dirty man. <laughs> what a disgusting sight. <laughs> okay, I'm just thinking about the Eden's Garden and Cassidy. <laughs> Sora, babe, what are you doing with the scumbag? <laughs> uh, anyways, Yuki offered to help me since I'm suffering from amnesia. What? Amnesia? My sweet Sora has amnesia? Oh, my sweet Sora. Back off, buddy. Also, Sora's not my real name. I don't know my talent or who I was either or just anything. It can't be. How can that happen? How tragic. Just you wait, Sora. I'll use the power of the... Care... Oh, his last name. Uh, Kagarian name to help you regain your memories. Thanks. Stop ignoring me. I'm trying to talk over here. Ugh. Did I upset you? So sorry about that. You see, I'm a being who ex oh god. So I consider males to be in insignificant as pebbles in the streets. Are you for real? Uh, you're a male yourself. Anyway, now's not the time to be joking around. Do you even understand what kind of situation we're in? Don't be naive. Situation? We were told to go to some certain location, and then suddenly found ourselves on a deserted island. So you're not completely clu clueless? I'm serious. I can say for sure. But I think this might be a kidnapping case or something. What? A kidnapping? There's no way the school would do something this crazy. Maybe somebody figured out they could make uh, some easy cash by ransoming off uh, some of the most talented people in our country. So they kidnapped us. Trust me. I've been kidnapped a lot, so I trust no. Or so I should know. With a personality like this, I'm not surprised. Don't you think that's a bit too cynical? Plus, why are you so calm if you think we've been kidnapped? Be realistic. Realistically speaking, nothing bad has happened since we've arrived, nor are we caged or restrained in any way. I'm just trying to make the best of it. That's... That kind of worries me. Being forced to talk to males gives me a headache. How about spending a relaxing afternoon chatting with me, Sora? Oh, thanks, buddy, but I have to talk to other people. I am at your service. Feel free to speak to me whenever you feel comfortable. I'm always willing to. Uh, I'm always willing to lend an ear to a lady. There are a lot of beautiful ladies to g get out of here. But not you. Yasuke? Was it you? Yukon? You? Who? It's Yuki Maida! Okay, Yuri Kagarin? I forgot how he pronounced it. That guy's half Russian. That's thing, half Russian, half I imagine Japanese. His family, his family is famous for being the powerhouse of the astronomy world. He's very slimy. Well, I can't help but agree. And that's it. Okay, finally, that took about an hour, but we did it. Now what? Sounds about right. I think we've explored pretty much everywhere. I mean, obviously, we're gonna get more unlocked as the game goes along, but there, there were a lot of different people. I think there was 15 in total, including you and I. Just 15 again? Dang it! Well... Yeah, but in the end, we still couldn't find any clues about what's going on. And everyone was really calm about it. 
Maybe the situation isn't that serious. Hmm. I guess so. You think so? I still have a bad feeling about this. Sora, why don't we gather everybody together for now and, and uh so we can discuss some stuff? It's probably um it's probably better to deal with what's going on as a group rather than on our own. You're right. Then let's split up and gather people. We'll regroup here. All right. Got it. You go west and you go east. Whatever. I'll go west, you go east. Let's move. <laughs> 